Hi everyone, I just created this script that allows you to take a screen capture of the area inside this transparent GUI by pressing this button. And once I press this button, you'll see the screen capture being saved down into this folder. You can move this GUI around to take a capture of wherever you want, like that. And this also has an auto capture function, which uses this value as the interval to capture the area every X number of seconds so you can see the screenshot is being created like that I can move that around and also maximize to capture the whole screen if you're interested in this topic please continue watching all right welcome back so I created this script because oftentimes I found myself in a meeting at work where other people were sharing their screen with me and I found myself taking screenshots of that in order to save them to refer back to them later. So I used to do that manually and I found that a little bit cumbersome so I created this script that allows me to easily take screen capture by pressing a button or automatically capture the screen every X seconds. Now. I'm not necessarily going to go through every single line of this code because this code is very, very long and it uses GDIP library, which I haven't covered yet, which I'm going to cover in future. And also this obviously has a lot of GUI elements that go into the script. So because I haven't created GUI tutorial yet, I am not going to go into the details, but I show you in this video how to use this. So let me close out of this first and then start anew. So this, this is where the script is saved. The script is called test script one. And I'm going to just delete this screenshots folder because the script creates that folder for me if the folder doesn't exist. So if I run this script, I will get this GUI, which I can move around using this uh, little cross thing in the right bottom corner. I can move it around by pressing that, holding down the left mouse button and moving around. And then this capture button obviously takes the screen capture of this re rectangular area. So if I press that, now there was no folder before the folder has been created just now, the screenshots folder. If I go into it, I'll see uh, this is the timestamp of today in the hour, minute, seconds. And uh, this is the area that is captured that is shown in this little GUI here. So that's pretty much it in terms of taking a screenshot. I can resize this to make it bigger and take a screen capture. And there you go, that's that's captured as well. And uh, auto capture function is, is basically you've got up and down GUI control here that increases or decreases the interval and this is in seconds, so it's 33 seconds. Um, and if you click that, that's going to show the red icon here. That means, you know, the screen is being captured every interval. So you can see a new file is being created. Um, I can move this folder inside as well to see that's being captured as well. You can move it out and I can also maximize this to take a screen capture of everything. So now it's taking the whole screen. Um, I can decrease the interval. And if when I decrease the interval, it's going to create the screen captures a lot faster. And I can restore this to bring the window size back to the normal default size and minimize it. If I minimize it while the auto capture is on, it's just going to create these black boxes. And then if you want to show it again, then you've got to, this is the taskbar icon that you can use to bring the window back. And that that's pretty much it. And uh, I'll upload this script onto my website. So if you don't know how to access the script on my website, please watch this video until the end. There will be an instruction at the end. And before we go, I'll just quickly show you what I did on Netflix with this script. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. When Bill Gates stepped down from Microsoft in 2008, he was worth more than $58 billion. 
he built that fortune thinking about computer software, operating systems, spreadsheets, and the internet. <laughs> 